we've been busy. We've been busy. Nanny Di has sort of fell off the face of the earth. You see the, the curly-haired Nadia. Nadia Swaller of the telly. Yeah. Just say hello to Green Fingered Hell. Hello, Green Fingered Hell. Yeah. How are you? That's Nadia Swaller of the telly. Right there on our sofa. Nadia Swaller of the telly. This is Nanny Di. Off the telly, not off the telly. Not off the telly. Yes. And we're going to, are we going to look at the garden? I think we're going to look at the garden. Anyway, so here's the thing. Mm. I can already see something that I'm There's gonna... been an awful lot of rain this week, which meant that I didn't have to feel guilty about not watering. Okay, good. Except... Yeah. But it meant that I didn't go out, so I haven't looked. But okay. anyway, things that have happened since you've been here. Yeah. Stephen has decimated half the garden, but I think it's a good thing. In the, in yeah, the long it run, it can only, be a, good, can only be a good thing. So he's kind of done that, so that's a help. Oh, look, little Robin just landed. Oh. The... Fledgling blue ticks have left home. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. Sweet, isn't it? Very sweet. Um, it's quite windy out there, so that's why I'm paused here at the minute. Okay. And I've managed to stake and uh, tie some roses and a few bits and bobs because I felt they were kind of all beginning to fall over. So okay. that's all I've done. Right. Let's go. Okay. <gasps> sweet right. peas are growing. Oh, they never got their thing. No, Betty's did. When I said to you, oh, my sweet peas never worked, this is exactly what I meant. Yeah, and that I they need... started to sprout well, and then I never put them up. To be honest with you, I did order these things. The subs are going to go nuts. Why? I did order these, but these are enormous. Well, what you do is you plonk that in the wood, in the floor and yeah. you pull the string and they're supposed to grow up them. But that, it's too big. That, that is too big for these pots. And Rachel said they're going to go woody, those sweet peas, and they're not going to flower. No, exactly, exactly. Have you seen our new bird boxes? Come and see. Oh! Oh, they're beautiful. And they're really cheap. So From the uh, National, is it the National Trust? Yeah, the National Trust. Oh, my, have you got enough places to put and them? And what have I done? Why, why have I got them? What is notable about them? Squirrel proof. Absolutely, yeah. No. And that is the thing, that stops. See that ring round there, subs? Oh, is that, that stops? That stops, well, not just the squirrels, but the woodpeckers the and woodpeckers the crows and, the and all that kind of stuff. So they're eyes. lined up as homes for next year. Oh, but, that is so sweet. Subs, can you help us? Where's the best place to put a bird uh, house on a tree? Because we put one up there, you can just see it behind us. Yeah. And nothing took, nothing nested there, but we, could the, is it, if squirrels can get too close to it, do they need to be on a tree that squirrels can't get up? Yeah, you know I mean? nowhere near, maybe. And they run along that fence, squirrels, don't yeah, they? they? How do. long has it been up there, though? That was there before they, they settled in there. Oh. The subs love it when we unpack something. What is this? This is... Oh. This bag is not a toy, it keeps telling me. Uh... Dome feeder. What? It's also squirrel proof. The dome prevents the squirrel from being able to get in from the bottom or the top. Blimey, they've suddenly gone nuts on preventing squirrels. No, I've gone nuts on finding squirrel prevention stuff. Oh look, that's it in its finished form. Yes. So, oh, let's have a look at these. Yeah, hang on, let me. Oh look, you need to cut the effing carnations. Well, I was leaving it for, why are you getting so angry? Because you said don't cut them, don't no. cut them, don't cut them. Now that I've left them for you. Oh. One of them, one of them, you need to deadhead. Subs, have you have you heard over the over the many green fingers tells? Every time I try to deadhead anything, Mark goes, "Don't touch it! Don't pick it! Don't pick it! It won't come again." He's allowing me to deadhead that. Because it's dead. Yeah, but that's not worth going, isn't it? No, they're, no, they're, they're that's coming. not why you're doing it. You're picking it to increase. I don't understand why you don't understand this. To encourage the next you ones mean, to come. Of course, but you, you need them to flower for a period of time, otherwise you have no flowers. No, you don't. You don't. You cut them at this stage and then the next ones come. No. Can we just have a little bet on this? No. If I cut... I'm cutting those today. You've just given me there permission. There will be no flower... No, I... They, By they, next they, time I cut, they're all they coming. Will. They're all... It, it's happened. They're en route. This is, a, this is an existential madness. Do you mean you're only going to let me cut them when they're like that? No, when they're like that. When they flowered. Deadhead them. You don't deadhead them before they flower. This is not cool. This is not deadheading. It is. It's a mistaken idea of deadheading. Dead. No. Dead. 
No, wrong. that's not what you're it wrong. means. You're wrong. You're, I'm not wrong. You're bringing dead hit. Nanny Dye is saying and claiming if that you should to... take all of the buds that have come through yeah, that one's on these really flowers yeah. in order to encourage other. So when you've taken, okay, let me ask mm. you this. Yeah. So you take all those buds off, all of them. Would you take all of them off? No, I'd take the ones that are almost flowering because then they'll flower indoors and then your next ones will be coming. They'll flower indoors, they won't, they'll just die. They won't, they'll flower. So you're going to take Have all of those... Have you flowers from a florist? Are you going to take all those buds off? Not those, all of what, them, what but if that they're, one, that but one, what if that they're, one, that one, But they're one, the flowers one, for this season, Mum. No, they're not. They're the flowers it's giving us. You've got this idea that there's a, an endless supply of more. There is. There is for Look the at summer. That. Okay, well... Well, we're not going to agree on that, are we? We're not going to agree on that. But you've got to allow me to sort of try and prove my point. Um, Look, beautiful rose there. Why whoa. has that got pink on it? I don't know, but isn't it... You oh, see that? Oh, look, it's white. Oh. <laughs> no, but this is the... So we've got this two... Look, the, the, clematis the clematis is making is love to pink. the rose. Oh, this look. This is the clematis, look. What's happening here? <gasps> now, I saw one That's of That's a your... hibiscus. God, you and your hibiscus. Yeah. But also, I saw something on one of your vlogs, or, or one of your Green Finger Tales that I wasn't involved with, where how people... It, how do you feel when you're not involved with I didn't something? like it at all. I felt I was dead. Oh. I felt that you'd cut me out of it and that, that I was looking at myself from a, a, a dead position, yes. Uh, and then suddenly you and Nadia were talking about the life that was... Anyway, it's very weird. Anyway, oh. but the only good thing about That's it was... probably when social media isn't a good thing. I don't think it is. It wasn't in that instance. But I did, <laughs> but I did see a poppy, which was gorgeous. Oh, Mum, you missed the poppy. I know, and I felt very, very cheated by that. Well, at least I sent you the photo. No, you didn't. I, I went I online. You no, you didn't oh, send me a bloody photo. Well, anyway, that's the, the hibiscus is coming. Yes, but no, my look, point... You can see the flies there. Yeah, they need look. to just cut the whole thing. So some, someone was saying you need to spray <gasps> fairy liquid. Yeah. Where's your spray thing? Did we got a spray thing? I think we bought one, didn't we? Where we should have done. Where have I put it? What the F, you CK? Are you oh, kidding look at that. me? Isn't that beautiful? And you always move off as soon as I get my. What do we need to do with this rose? Book? I don't know. Okay, so let's, do, as we do a survey. Look, look at this, though. Look at it coming. This it's lovely, isn't it? It's very pretty. And look, that's coming out of that shop. That needs repotting, doesn't it? That's Does tiny. Mum. Is that the one that's flowering? That's oh, that's interesting. That's it, yes. That's unforgivable. That was one Mom. of the late ones you bought. <laughs> you are that's awful. neglect. <laughs> What was I trying to say about everything? They need to be repotted and you wouldn't let me repot anything practically. Some of the things down here are looking quite hot. Look at this clematis. Yes, hold on, what was I going to say about this? Oh, I read things, that was what I was going to say, where people were saying, you know, you, you and Nads were doing your thing where you, you had these sticks that had been sent to you and you're saying, how yes. can anybody send these? That was what was called, what, what did they all call it, the sub then? I've heard of that, where it's called dry root. Dry oh, right, root. Yeah, something, yeah. Planted. Did you plant any of them? Yeah, well, I'll show you. Oh, and they said yeah. that they would, they would come. Yeah. Good. And that sounded familiar. So look, beautiful rose subs. Look, so look, this rose here is all looking good. What's we this, need to this know what here, that rose is, though, Mark. This is the jasmine. The jasmine isn't doing... Is oh, the doing? jasmine will, will do. Yeah, will it, it's has, a it, has it done? Will no, it flower? No. It will eventually. The wisteria is down there. And the wisteria of, is... Anyway, biding yeah. its time. So let's move this way. So yeah. This very odd thing going on down here. We don't, none of us really know what's happening there. We do know. It's the Peter Dinklage of hibiscus. <laughs> it's not hibiscus. What it's, is it? It's a, an azalea. Uh, no, the other one. Begins with C. Needs ericaceous compost, but not. I don't think you've put enough ericaceous in there. Look at it. It's pathetic. It shouldn't have gone into that bigger pot. Right. It's the one that you've got down there that kept losing its things. Oh, that one's looking a bit better. What's it called? I don't know. Look, <gasps> no, the lavender's come. The lavender's come. I wish that was bushy. That's only you... come because I cut it right back to within an inch of its life. How do we make when that bushy? When you weren't here once. How do we make you wouldn't have let me cut that back, would you? No, I, I just know. know. I Look, love the colour. These, of... these need watering. You say that. Well, that, been... I think there's. Ha that's just ugly. What do we do with this? Oh, you can see. This is what worries me, subs, about. You see, when Mark says we've had a lot of rain in the week and so yes. they haven't needed to oh, be watered, they always do need looking at because yeah, no, these it trees. Torrential. It was torrential, but that almost means even more. Right. These ones will need. That's a hibiscus. That's doing all. Is yeah, that's suddenly gone nuts. Yeah, get gentle with it. I love the colour of these leaves on this. On these. These oh. are a different type of clematis. 
Yeah, there are so many different types of bread. Well, I'm wondering whether we need to be thinking. You know, so, Mark, well, you know where Stephen's cleared that other fence over there? Yeah. Do we need to get loads of stuff like this over there? Yeah. Yeah. In fact, we might be able to move some of this over there. Or stuff that... Yeah. I know. We couldn't, we couldn't so this is... So, look, yeah, all... What's that? Oh, these are, these are weeds. That's weed. The strawberries. The strawberries down there. Oh, and they were... Oh, look! Look! <gasps> look! Honeysuckle. Honeysuckle. Yeah. Honey, oh, oh, honey honeysuckle's suckle. out at the moment. Oh, honeysuckle's doing something. And in a minute, when it actually... No, you can't smell it. Bless you all. Smell You're it. Smelling the bird. Smell it. No, it has to come out as a flower before you can smell oh. it. But they're all... Well, aren't, aren't these the precursor of flowers? They are the precursor. Let's turn this around. This is too exciting. This has taken a year, well, a year and a half for yeah. it to do anything. Yeah. And it's just And it'll go beginning. like that in a minute. That, ah. That's the bird. That's the flower. And then the flower smells, as you know, honeysuckle oh, is different. Honey hey, oh, look. Just think, this eventually I'll be able to come out and just pick my vegetables and grow them. We're not growing any this year. No, but next year. Yeah, next I year. I saw these really good things. I don't know if you know them, Sub, if you know about them. They're almost like a fabric. Yeah. And you hang them on the wall. You can hang them on fences like that. And you grow herbs oh, yes. and salads. And yes. I thought, because if I'm honest, I do always feel a bit weird about salad on the ground with dogs and foxes. She feels weird about salad on the ground. Did you know that? Peeing on them. But then you Brenda, one of our loose women, she was showing us all her vegetables. She says, you just put nets over yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah. Just, yeah. Started just, nets just over don't everything. bother. Yeah, she said, if yeah. you don't put nets, just don't bother. Yeah. It just doesn't no, work. Exactly, exactly. And then our producer, who is a young girl, so we were talking about gardening the other day on the show. And she was, and we say, oh, the thing is, it's only when you get older you start. You know, we've had this it's garden true, for years. You know, and she, no, she's in her twenties. She said, no, young oh. people now. And I think it's tied up with the fact that we're all looking at the planet yeah. and what we've done yeah. to it. To and she things. said she was out at one o'clock in the morning the other day with her torch, searching for slugs. Because oh, oh, she's, she's so yeah. pissed off with them because yeah. they keep eating her stuff. And she put little things of beer. Well, that's what they all. Oh, beer. Yeah, beer. Beer. You put beer little. Kills them. Little tiny, little tiny little pints. of beer, and what? they fall into them. They get drunk, and then they love it. But it's a nice death, I think. Yeah, well, that was the way a lovely I used to death. kill them. And we were saying somebody must have invented one with a metal bit round the, the yeah, doorway. Yeah, they're squirrel-proof and they're, pred so they're nice. predator-proof. Are you going to put them up? Well, yeah, but I'm going yeah, to. We're waiting for the right place, place to put them. I've asked the subs where to put them. But, well, what? But they're has been bloody brilliant. We've had the most gorgeous. Yeah, exactly. you can't just you can't just put them all there. No. So we're trying trying to find a place that has the same optimum. Yeah. But the thing is, they're from the National Trust and they're really reasonable. How much were they? They're about nine pounds each. <gasps> really cheap. That's so good. Yeah, we have cheap. to become members of the National Trust. It's I want to become a member of the National Trust. Yeah. And I thought that was something that you did when you were really old and boring. No, it's not. No, it's, it's not. No, you're absolutely right. Well, it it's is, not. But it's not boring. <laughs> we're old, but it's not boring. What so else is I going to say? We've done the thing about slugs. You know We've that. got to think about the barbecue. Oh, have just we? Just in case we get a summer. Where are we going to put the barbecue? Well, the problem because I want to get a nice. That's you rubbish. That barbecue it cost me twelve quid because it didn't have. Yeah, a no, wheel. no, no, no. Well, yeah. Well, a good barbecue. I, I think. Mean, could it work round here? What have we got planned? Well, we were going to grow something up the wall there to cover that that embarrassment. Mm -hmm. See, I don't want it too far away because it's a real pain in the ass. When I was going to say the most to logical place is on the is on the thing over there, but I think that corner there is your spot. Okay. Personally, I yeah. think I always in my head think of that corner. Okay. I'm pointing over there where that where the old one is, and I think if you get a really nice sturdy one there. Yeah, we need a sturdy one. Yeah. I want one that's really easy to clean. Who can recommend a good barbecue? It has to be charcoal. I don't want a gas. But somebody was saying to me, why don't you just get a gas one and throw on the hickory chicks, which is what you want to do. Hickory. I want to do all that sort of, of strange, sort of flavoured coals. Yeah. Well, let's have a look flavored at a barbecue later. Coals. Another thing I want to get is because the girls had so much fun last summer. The a hammock, honestly, if you're wanting to encourage your kids to read, get a hammock. We've created. Because last summer, because there was that yeah. hammock there, yeah. they kept sitting well, in no, it I'm and reading. To, we haven't really had enough sun, constant no, sun, really. have we? But we've created, me and Stephen have created enough wood chip. How much chip does a wood chip chip if a wood chip chip chipper chipper chippers? Chip 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 I'm like going to show you what trees. we've done. Oh, okay, Wait till you see what's, Wait till you see what's happened over there. Okay. But anyway, so yeah, now. So I thought, I thought, yeah. what about having some salad growing on here? Yeah, salad, salad. they're puppets. called salad pouches. Yeah, I like them. Okay, we'll look into that. 
You can even have them on the tree. You can have them going. Mum, you're looking a bit aghast. Flexible. It's Mom, this bit here. They're flexible. You can have them growing around yeah. the salad. Yeah. 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 I yeah do around spend the tree. A on good salad. I know. I know. I want but babe, salad. I grew you a load of salad over there, and you didn't use any of it. Not critical, but the grow again lettuce that was growing away very nicely. You never used one one It was a two full pots of lettuce, and I kept saying, "You can I be honest? Can I just say that? Can I be honest? Can I be honest? Yeah. I had it. It was Why lovely. What did you say? I had some. It was really tasty. The actual brand of lettuce wasn't nice. a bit chemically and a bit thick. Oh, that Please. must be the seed. That must be the type of I lettuce. Like I think you might have just made that. Up. I think you no, might no, have just made genuinely. That. But can I, I also like just it. say that when? Excited excited by by it. Can I? Can I just? Can I just? I'd love a butterball lettuce. Oh, but can I just say that when when we do grow veg, you do go into a sort of slight aversion sort of thing. Something kicks in where your eyes go a bit weird. I get really worried about who's pissed on it. Well, it's only me. <laughs> look, the look, the allium have finally got little buds. Yeah, but they're, they're, they're doing pulled. so poorly. I think we need to pull them up and abandon the allium. Do you think we thing? abandon the allium? They're but supposed also, to be, aren't they supposed to be erect? <sighs> yes, they are. Aren't they supposed to be pointing to the stars? Yes, but also there's something wrong with that soil because the protentillas aren't doing anything. Well, they are. They're green again. They were dead. They were dead. They were brown. They should be covered in blooms. Oh, will you carve me now or tonight? Tonight. Tonight, yeah. Have that you seen the irises I've put down there? Yeah, I saw that one. Yes, 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 yes. That's good. The de the tulips have gone in there for next year, haven't they? The ones there. Yeah, they're all there. But look, these are doing fantastic because you won't get probably any blooms now. Well, there's. I mean, there's Although something there's one odd happening. Yeah, I know, but it's so small. It looks like it's slightly disturbed. Stunted. Yeah. yeah stunted. But, but they're growing. But that's, that's the a good point. To me, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and look, look, lots of roses about to go. Yeah, that's good. That's By your good. standards, you deadhead them, yes? No! Look, those two, these are the things we received in the post. I've just planted them up, but God only knows if they're going to survive. Roses. Roses? These are roses. When you say you've received... Remember the two we were going to put in the... Oh, yes, 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 yes. Um... So, yeah. When, when I know did what you mean. That, the, the, you are, look, see, I think this is actually. The, these are just building their foundations. I think. I think they're okay. I'm very disappointed with that whole the, steps the school, thing. The school, yeah, the school round the corner. Alliums are growing up to the sky, and they just do nothing with them except just leave them. But um. Anyway, doesn't maybe, look good, does it? No, not really. Doesn't look good. So eventually, subs, we're thinking of having a little dingly sort of. Windy little pathway through there. It looks like there was one. Well, there. the dogs are treading it through. Oh, okay. And if you look on the floor here, squirrels have come and vandalised <gasps> the nut feeder, <gasps> hurling it around, and the other feeder. Look here. Whoa! In their anger at not being able to get yeah. into baby birds, maybe. And look what I've just found. What have you found? What does that mean? Is that a sign? <laughs> what do you mean? Is it is a that sign? A sign? Is that like Blair Witch or something? Is that like a witch? Or Yuri Geller is somebody bending spoons. Maybe the squirrels bent the bent the spoon and broke into was, the. Yeah. But that's the other fit. Where's the top of that feeder? Anyway, there's vandals, squirrel vandals in this garden. Well, we know that, don't we? Though, I mean. Look, I put this. Uh, so let's wander through here. Yeah. Let's wander through. So this area is kind of looking after itself, isn't it? Just needs pruning and preening and. and oh no, after. we haven't looked at these ones though. This. <laughs> what is it? It's a pyrocanthus. Oh, yes. It needs not to be there. Does it need to be in a bed? Um, yes, it would do better in a bed. Because some, some of our subs are saying you need to get some of those out of pots and into beds. Yeah. Oh, look, that What's rose happened is to this rose? Beautiful. Is it? Oh, my God, it's being eaten alive. What's it, happened to that? It's, it's being eaten by whatever's eating the... That's, that's yeah, not black spot, though. I think that's um, rust. Do they call it rust? You see, now that wants to be cut off so that you can have the benefits of a rose because it's not going to flower there. It's going to be eaten like that. Which is a bit sad, don't you think? Um, I literally palms, don't understand it. I know what you're going to have to do in the end, Mark, is make this a palm. Yeah. Which we know they're doing really do well. We put, so, what, so what are you saying? Everything needs to come out of the pots and go into somewhere else? I don't know. It's not gardeners that have a... Have a, a gorgeous bird with weed glasses from Primark coming out. Oh, thing. look at this! A thing you lovely no, dated. Right from Joe. So this is this is from Joe. What I found. Do you want a spoon? No, thank you. Coconut and chocolate smoothie. Go green smoothie. This is mint. I'll have a go green smoothie. 
A go green smoothie. Go green smoothie. Look at this, guys. Look what I got on eBay. Look, it's a brass Ooh, feeder. Have creamy mushrooms on soup. Do you like that? Yeah, but you've got those. That's ones nice. On. It's yeah. a feeder. Look. There's oh, the poppy God, there's head. Some deadheading he's Look doing at the poppy here. head here. So you can oh! do. Yeah. Yeah. No. Who's that there? Who's that? Now, I need to ask you a question. What the hell? What is that? What is it? What is that? I don't know, Mark. I do not know. And here, look, these beautiful poppy heads come to an end. It's such a shame. I can't believe we're going to lose that. But look, these are all dead. So what do you do with these then? You deadhead them. Yeah, I'll, get, I'll they, get some scissors. Yeah. And come yeah, back yeah. Through. yeah. But look, these things have come through. Look, sweet things. Oh, aren't they sweet? But look, Mum, can I just oh, ask, what the hell are these? These were the things that you... Look, no flower has come out of them. <laughs> other, other than just giant, giant leaves. Like these? Ones. What are they? <laughs> I think there's some type of primrose. Well, that's what I thought Isn't they were. It? I'm going to have to pull them out because they're overwhelming everything else. <laughs> I've never seen anything like them. They look like some type of vegetable. I know. If you've got a rabbit, the rabbit could eat them. But look at the lupins. The lupins are doing well. Look. <gasps> Fantastic. They? Really look at take... this, though. Yeah, don't touch it. It's poisonous. Very poisonous. Digitalis, is that? Yeah, apparently, Fuck yeah. Them. But, well, and of course that's reseeding. That will reseed here. Yes. And we'll get loads more. And are the Me, bees going into it? Seen so many bees. Have you in really? There. No, I really have seen so many bees. Oh, that is fantastic. Yeah, and you know what Monty Monty Don said? What? He said, you know, I kept saying that thing about going to Amsterdam and getting those white tulips and they didn't come back. He said the tulip is really a one flowering flower despite what some some people have said and you know i showed you how some of yeah, the tulips are going off. he said they're always tiny and always secondary and they're never as good as the first oh. thing and that's if you're lucky enough to oh. get so we might not do very well with the right. tulips that come back so but he asking, said it so you were asking about the trees yes so careful because that that come over here Lupins. Come over here this was the <laughs> oh. that's the twig I can't even tell if it's taken. How long has it been in all there? All of this, Stephen says, is weeds. We have to get rid of it all is, of this. This has is. trailing stuff. We need to weed it. it. I, you can see, this is. I weeded all around here, and this is all starting to come up again. Mm. Look, lovely wild. This is a wild rose bush that's starting to come up. I don't know if you've noticed, but I've actually pulled off that. I chainsawed that. Oh! I chainsawed, look behind you, somewhere <gasps> there. That is another one of the trees that we received. I Wait, think that's the cherry tree. When did you plant those, love? These were about three weeks ago. Do you think they're a bit That's exposed? the little rose that came. So um, all of this has to come down, all of this. Look, and he managed to pull that huge old tree <gasps> trunk out. God, I bet he was... And he's, he's left his, his spade yeah. to mark the spot. How about this, if I do this today? Is weed, weed this bit as much as I can yeah. and put some stuff in from there. From yeah, the ones but let me know where you're going to put them before you put them in. To, to ask you if it's all right. Yeah, no, no, because yeah. I just I'm, I, I'm just trying to curate the space so that we. No, 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 absolutely. I quite but like I think... Lupin Corner here. I like. No, no, sort of I, wouldn't, I wouldn't put them near there, but maybe just to get them out of those yes. things. And yeah, they're yeah. not doing well you, you there. Might anything need me that's to, not doing well. Yeah, anything that's not doing well over there. Yeah, yeah let's bring over it. Yeah. I don't think we should take anything from that. So basically, here's the thing: because this is what we've done, subs. Is this going to be a bit of a boring green figure? We've just shown you everything as it is, but we're showing you, giving you a status report, yeah. so that we can then sort of show you what we're going to do. But let me: the biggest change in the garden in recent weeks that we need to be thinking about at the back of our heads yes. is this. Ooh. This was an enormous. Oh, here, no, here, look. Here's the. Uh, Here's the thing that he pulled out of the... Oh my God! It's huge, isn't it? Yeah. Huge. You know people make whole features he's out gonna, of dead trunks, don't yeah, you? He's going to make something out of that. I think he's yeah. going to make a sort of... But look over here. So the, what you can't... You might have seen from one of the previous Green Fingered Hells. Look, tree's gone there. Oh my God. Huge tree, in fact. It was a huge tree. That's fantastic. Yeah, so that's gone. And then look over here. Yeah, area. until you walk into it. But look at all of this space. Now, what he's found in here yeah. is magnolia right. tree. It is a magnolia tree. This was tree. the magnolia tree that used to be beautifully in bloom. And like Steve said, it's now just become so stringy yeah. because it was fighting against all of this. Yeah. So he's pulled that out. 
Obviously there's an old wisteria there. He's found bits and so basically we've got an entire bed. But yeah, okay, I'll yeah. get your point. So anyway, so we've got a magnolia tree back, which Otherwise we need to curate and look everything. after. Yeah. Well, so what, what, what is this tree here? Because he's left Lilac. This, oh, lilac. Lilac. Is it? Now, yeah, you can see, look there. Oh yeah. Um, so we're keeping that. Yeah. But look, so that bed, I don't know if you remember, the, the, the grass goes all the way up there. But look, we've got all this, an enormous, enormous, I mean, enormous area. To yeah. somehow now fill. I mean, at some point, this was obviously, I mean, you've got bamboo, you've got Rose of Sharon, whatever the Latin name for that is. Flower bed. I know. Because that, that. Oh, look, there's a tree here. That's yeah. Gone. That, that's, that is a sort of big pot that's it's, it's gets, a got barrel. full of. Like yes. A barrel. I remember when I was doing the garden, that yeah. was there. Um, so, look, so yeah. So basically, we've got all of this area. So, we've got this bed is coming through. But this bed over here... Can you see the white thing? I think that's the end of a Montana, Clematis Montana. Yeah, there is a Clematis there. Yeah. It's become a tree. Yeah. And that's not good in a way, because it doesn't just mean that, that things like Clematises can go from, you know, a climb or something to a tree. I mean, this is over, not centuries, subs, obviously, but a long, long time. Because how long ago is it since I did the garden? A long time. Well, we're talking um, at least about... 10 years, 10 years ago. 10 years. And that was that was then, and I didn't touch some of these things, but these were, were then almost gone. Yeah, They're too shocking. mature, it was too... And what's really sweet, I mean, it's so like an archaeological dig, because what Stephen's done, which is great here, which he had to do for Betty, he's cleared this whole area. So that's just shown a myriad of sins. Yeah. And that's just like, and in, that in itself is a garden to be dealt with. Yeah. Then we've got this bed here, which is where the fig tree is. That's a whole thing to... So I think we're kind of wise managing the one bed that we know we can see oh, yeah. and deal with. But of course, all these other beds have to be dealt with gradually, otherwise they'll gradually. overgrow again. Well, they do, but as Monty Don says, and even he says it, he can only deal with one bed at a time. Does he say deal that? Deal with one Please bed Please tell me that. Time. Say that again. Monty Don, bless him, and I watch his programme happily, yeah. says only deal with one bed at a time. Monty, Monty that has salved my heart. Oh, well, no, because I feel so stressed idiot. about it. But you're dealing with one bed. What does he do with the other beds? Well, he does a bit of tweaking, like I'm going to sort of take some deadheads off and stuff like that. But basically, don't forget he grows vegetables as well. He's always like, mm. like going picking vegetables. But anyway, well, look, come over here and I'll show you the extent to which. So obviously all this tree stuff. So this lawn that I'm standing on now, yeah. was this high, you'll probably seen from the green figure, was this know. high with stuff, which I then dragged. So here's obviously trees left here. We're thinking of trying to perhaps use those as edging. We're thinking of using the old trunks as edging for beds. It might you know be- what, they pay a fortune for those in a national park. Because they use them, they, you don't no, throw anything like well, that exactly. away. exactly, rather than someone else using them, what can we use them for? Now, me and Steve were talking about this and he was saying, you could exploit their uneven sort yeah, of side and use them as the edge of a bed. Well, yeah, you could Put them do on the that. edge of a bed. What do you think, Subs? What should we do with old trunks? Look behind yeah. us. What are these pink, beautiful flowers, Mum? Yeah, roses. But wild, what they call wild. So is that something you planted back in the day? No, it was already there. But can we keep that? Is well, that like the one that's down there? Yeah. But look at this, guys. That I planted. This you planted. And yeah. so when you do the... Bless it. Does smell it smell? It. Smell that. Oh my God, it does as well. Beautiful. Oh, let's cut so it this, off and put it in the kitchen. Well, yeah, so the thing is, is that this <laughs> didn't is... didn't say no, Subs. This is so, this is so leggy. Yeah. But what I, that makes me... What I love about that is, is within there, there's the remnants, Mum, of your love and attention. Yeah. That and makes also, me sad. I, I don't... Stop it. There are two, you know, there's climbing roses and rambling roses. I've talked yes. to you about this What's before. This? They're very, I don't know, but that's clearly one of those. So when, rambling is very different. Yes. And that might be rambling in its way out of that morass. Right. So know. when we get to this bed, can you, can I ask you to try and keep some of this pretty pink rose and try and keep some of the white mm -hmm. rose? People often use that for hedging. We had it at Bennett's, I don't know if you remember. It's I so slowly pretty. got rid of it. Yeah, I know the flowers are pretty, but, but the actual. Um, shrub. Shrub is like just like black black um, berries. The subs won't even know about this area here. Well, they saw me, but look, half the wood has been. We got a shredder in. How did you do that? We got a we got a wood chipper. 
Me and Stephen were shoving stuff into a wood chipper. I'll show you the film. Was, I had a, my man crush moment with Steve. But did you, did you film it? Yeah, filmed some of it, yeah. Oh, good. Well, I'll look at it at home. But yeah, so yeah. all of that is... Why don't you stop putting it on the... Yeah, but we need to work out where to put it. You need to put it on the soil over winter. Yeah, but over winter, exactly. If we put it on the soil now, it just blocks it out. How so, long did it take you to get... We, we had it for one day, but that got rid of half of this. But as you can see, after Stephen's assault, we now have just a lot. Oh, it feels done. so enormous. No, it, it is. Well, yes, but Mark, it was always going to be that way. Mm. And, and, and in actual fact, you've done, you've done what an army of gardeners couldn't have done. Mm. I mean, you and Stephen, I mean, you know, all those years ago I was doing it, I knew it wasn't a job for one person. No. And. Yeah, and you were trying to explain that yeah, and I wasn't having any yeah. of it. I mean, the thing is, is that Stephen's absolute brazen kind of that on that side there really yeah, well. is great. I've done the same thing in the middle bed, so I think we can only look at that as a productive year. Oh, God, and from, yes. And, and from there, we just take it. Yes, I mean, I think Nadia doesn't understand. It's gonna. This is a five-year project. It is. And also, don't forget Monty's other thing, which is useful to know, is that you said it's really hard this year because nobody knows what's happening with the weather. All the plants are being mm. encouraged to grow, produce their flowers, and then suddenly we get, like, two weeks yeah. of downpour and cold, almost cold. Yeah. So, so the flowers don't know what to do. So I'm thinking of salvaging all of the sort of trunky type uh, trunks yeah. and I think we could possibly use them to edge even the bed that you're about to start clearing stuff from yeah so what I've just done is just lifted up one of the logs and just chucked it down there and I'm just thinking would that be quite a nice way to edge the each bed I tell you what it would kind of help psychologically with mum using those logs yeah is to demarcate all the beds yeah just so yeah. that we know what we're dealing with yeah yeah, yeah. I think okay. our food's ready so that's just a catch-up. Yeah. That's a catch-up.